Certainly nothing like that that we have to contend with, but we have kind of our own version of severe weather with all this smoke, although it sounds like things are slowly improving. Yes, yeah, Sally in some parts dropped 20 inches of rain, and the problem with Sally is it's a slow mover. We would love to get some, not 20 inches, but we would love to get some rain here in the Pacific Northwest, help dampen down the fires, wash away some of our smoke, but keep in mind, if we do get any heavy rain at all, it also can lead to mudslides where we have the, bur the recent burn scars. So. You know, it's kind of a mixed blessing there. Well, let's talk about this weather wise. We've got 75 degrees in Spokane, 77 in Coeur d'Alene, 82 in Ritzville, and it's 84 degrees now in Moses Lake. Areas where we're seeing the temperatures warming up now, and that means we're seeing less smoke. That means more of the sun is able to get down to the surface and heat things up. Uh, current wind speeds, and again, most of these are easterly winds. That's what we want. We want easterly winds that'll blow the smoke to the west. So, but again, they're not very strong winds. We've got seven mile an hour winds in Spokane, five in Ritzville. Calm winds up towards uh, Sandpoint and Kettle Falls and down into St. Mary's. Here it is right here. Here's the low pressure system. This is what we hope is going to move on shore and we think it will and then move over into the inland northwest by Friday and Friday night. Friday night and Saturday right now look like the best chance we can get some rain. For your 12 hour forecast, as you can see, the overnight lows dropping down into the low uh, to mid 50s and certainly dry weather. 79 expected in Grand Coulee tomorrow, 75 in Omax, 76 in Ephrata. Again, we'll look, some areas will have more smoke than others. We're just all areas are going to get haze uh, and then some areas especially like here in the Spokane Basin we're still going to see smoke tomorrow 77 in Spokane 78 expected in Coeur d'Alene 76 will be the high in Sandpoint looking for a high of 78 in Pullman and Colville down to 47 tonight and then a daytime high of 77 so I think we're going to get smoky skies on Thursday into a bit of Friday and then as soon as that rain begins to fall, we should begin to see uh, increasing our, uh, air quality. So we'll go for 79 on Friday and it is a cool front. We dropped 9 degrees on Saturday. I'm looking for a better weekend air quality wise. It's also going to get windy and let's not rule out thunderstorms. Friday afternoon, Friday night into Saturday morning. Sunday now looks like it'll be mostly dry and then we'll look for low 70s, really seasonal temperatures and partly cloudy skies expected for much of next week.